what is up y'all it's your girl miracle and today i'm back with a new mother freaking video hold on let me drink my coffee real quick this is that delight iced vanilla coffee the best ever they call me miss i-n-d-e-p-e-n-d-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-e-n-t-
drawers are empty. And then I just have to put my clothes in the little clothes bags. And then I'll be finished. But yep. Yeah. I'll check in with y'all on Friday. When I pack some more stuff. You can't feel me. I just wanna. I, we're not gonna do that. I just wanna. Yeah, let me. Let me I feel your heart. But if I make fake commitments. Maybe I can construct something that looks. And I'm not going to claim you in front of nobody. But just make sure you're there when it's time to. <sighs> Had a hard day at work. Cuddling. Frustrated about the outcome. Cuddling. See, this is the thing I, I learned about cuddling. Write this down. Cuddling usually happens behind closed doors. You don't see nobody out in public cuddling. Like, they don't be, like, laying down on a park bench cuddling. So most of the relationships that are counterfeit that we allow into our life that have the opportunity to leave us compromised, it happens in the dark behind closed doors. My question is, where are the relationships that nobody knows you're in? Who has the key to the door? Because the truth of the matter is, can't nobody help you behind a closed locked door. Too many believers are cuddling. We don't even know you're friends with that person, but every time we get around them with you, there's this weird vibe. You want to get with me, stop. Gonna get my clothes and then yeah 